Hi guys, Techman here. Today I want to talk a little about VTAC, a company I stumbled upon during my trip to the Solar and Storage Live Exhibition 2023. Now, VTAC are a global supplier and manufacturer of LED lighting solutions. The company is based in Belgium and has a strong presence in Europe, Asia, the Middle East, the US and Africa. They cater for both residential and commercial lighting needs, providing energy efficient and environmentally friendly solutions. And they've recently expanded and added solar solutions to their portfolio. I caught a glimpse of a couple of power stations on display at the exhibition and had a comprehensive and intriguing chat with sales director Kashish. But first, a quick word from VTAC CEO Dinesh. We've been in the UK for over 10 years now wow. and uh, we, we are predominantly very well known in the lighting sector uh, and now we've got into renewables uh, about an year now but within a year we have the whole range you know you can you can literally choose everything from mounting systems to solar panels to power stations and lithium batteries we have the whole range here. brilliant excellent so that's solar lithium ion phosphate modular yes, batteries yes, yes brilliant excellent. so for the for the solar you know the Solar the storage install. for the solar installs here. Yeah. Brilliant. So that would be like a feed-in tariff into the house, etc. Yes, correct, correct, correct. I mean, my channel is mainly, uh, predominantly features portable power stations, which okay. is why I went straight to that one. Yeah. Nice to hear from the CEO himself. And he came across as a nice fella, approachable and down-to-earth. And I respect that. He's also not afraid to step in front of the camera. You can find him flaunting his knowledge and charisma in many of their videos. Now, I discussed a number of things with sales director Kashish. Things like VTAC power stations, their target market, the importance of customer service, etc. Here's some of the highlights from our discussion. So basically, I'm actually running the customer service department and we have around five uh, to six different agents and uh, what they can actually do is in certain of our equipment, they can actually remotely uh, log in and even like you know fix things if they need to. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, brilliant. But at the same time, we've also got engineers on site. You know that can do video calls with people if they need to. Uh, we're also building this whole database, the knowledge base of like videos, of different kind of features that you can do on on the actual like, power station. So it really helps people like, you know identify the different features. But if anybody is having any kind of issues at all, we've got WhatsApp. Uh, Number, you know, that people can get us in touch with, uh, emails, phones, and like you know, they're all locally based in the UK. Do you have an app as well they can use? An app, or is that in development? It's, it's probably in development, we're not, we don't have that at the moment, but yeah, basically, it's going to be very much like you're talking to a person, like human interaction, and yeah, and, and you, you, you get your uh, you get whatever you need resolved. Right. And, and, okay. and uh, our trust by the reviews and Google reviews speak for themselves, and so you can have a look at it. Excellent. Where's your biggest market? Is it here in the UK, EU, or the US? Or? Uh, I would say a, a mixture of Europe. EU probably much bigger than the UK. I mean, we are kind of looking at them separately now because of Brexit and stuff. Absolutely. But uh, yeah, definitely the whole of Europe is one of our biggest markets. Right now, the EU has a lot more market share than the UK. But we're slowly but slowly getting there. We're trying to compete with our EU counterparts. If somebody today wants to buy this power station, can they buy on Amazon? Or what, what, what marketplace we're, are they looking at? Right now, Amazon, we're on a few independent uh, online uh, sites, like for example, CPC is a big site that people use. Yes. Smart lighting. So, all you need to do is go to Google and type in VTAC Power Station, and you'll find like a bunch of independent wholesalers. We try to make sure that you know Amazon is not, Amazon is an amazing route to market, but sometimes your brand tends to like you know get diluted and all that stuff there. So, we're trying to like make sure we have a good strategy in place. Right? Right. Okay. And we're trying to support independent wholesalers. And when I was speaking to you earlier, you said you're applying to make a thousand and two thousand watt power station. Absolutely. Is that? Is so now we've got a three hundred and six hundred. Let me just quickly show you a quick screenshot. So you got the three hundred, the six hundred. We're going to be adding a thousand and a two thousand. Mm -hmm. And then obviously, the way you charge this is obviously through the mains. You've got a car charger, uh, and then you can use a solar panel. Solar panels. As well. You've got the folding one, different voltages, and you've got a flexible one as well. And you manufacture both the folding and, and, the, and the flexible? Yes, 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 100%. We've got them in stocks locally available, and as I said, to our distributors. Just in terms of warranty, with a base product, something like this, the 300 or the 600, how, how many years of warranty would you normally provide? Uh, I've been dealing with so many products, yes, yeah, three years of warranty. Three years, that's standard. I mean. Guys, a lot of times you get a year or two years, these guys are providing three years of, of standard warranty. And I guess the larger power stations might have more years, wouldn't they? Well, I'll give the feedback, but we are getting it developed. That's what people are looking for. 
VTAC is growing fast into the solar technology sector with power stations, solar inverters, and a range of other solutions. During my conversation with Kashish, it became evident that they are fully committed to the solar industry and are taking it very seriously. They're researching the industry in detail and finding new ways to not only compete with their rivals, but they want to meet the needs of customers by providing innovative solutions and developing new products. Kashish and Dinesh expressed a keen interest in sending units for evaluation on the channel and to get suggestions on how to improve their products. However, as of now, I haven't received any updates from them regarding featuring their products on the channel, so I will be dropping them an email to see if they wish to feature on the channel. At the time of the exhibition, they were in the process of revealing the new 2016 Watt Hour Portable Power Station, and it will be interesting to check out its features and put it through its paces. Right guys, as always, thanks for watching, stay safe, stay green, and I'll catch you in the next one.